Hey, my name is Molly Sturgeon. Two of the healthcare fields I chose are phlebotomy technicians and pharmacy technicians. First, I'm going to tell you a little bit about a phlebotomy technician. A phlebotomy technician's main job is to draw blood. As a phlebotomy technician, organization and good record management is very important. A phlebotomy technician also needs to have good communication skills because most people are very nervous about needles and blood. I know I am. A good phlebotomist will have a calming and sensitive nature. Phlebotomy techs work in laboratories, hospitals, blood centers, home health care agencies, and doctor's offices. Certification is not required, but your chances of getting hired are much better if you are certified. Phlebotomists make around 30000 annually. An increase in aging population will lead to a greater need for phlebotomy technicians. And now I'm going to tell you a little bit about pharmacy technicians. Pharmacy technicians aid the pharmacist. They may fill prescriptions, which involves weighing, counting, measuring, and mixing medications. Accuracy is very important in this career. Pharmacy techs will work in pharmacies, including grocery stores, drug stores, and hospitals. Pharmacy techs can learn through on-the-job training. They may complete a post-secondary education program. Requirements for state licensing and certification. The address salary for a pharmacy technician is $29,000 annually. The job market for pharmacy techs is growing due to people living longer and the development of new drugs and cures.